Mark Lawler, pastor here at the parish of St. Vincent de Paul. And it was with great joy that we celebrated our dedication of the ministry center and chapel. Well, I would like to present some of the highlights of our new facility. Uh, certainly, we're very pleased with our chapel, but really the whole facility is well designed and well built. The chapel of the Holy Family, dedicated in loving memory of Victor Saya, who is the father of one of our parishioners and very devout man. Our memorial stone, which was blessed last year at the groundbreaking Chapel of the Holy Family. If the Lord does not build the house, in vain do its builders labor. The new crucifix for the chapel is, is uh, I think, a, a great meditation on the passion of Christ. The carving of the body of Christ was carved by a friend of mine in Peru. My brother made the cross and, uh, and placed the body on the cross. And uh, my brother made the cross to have that rough hewn look, which makes sense as in those days it would not have been a, a smooth, plain finish, but it would have been rough. So I think it's a great meditation and really on the suffering and the sacrifice of our Lord. And over here we'll do marriage prep, we'll do uh, counseling and also funeral preparation with the blessing of the stained glass window here of the resurrection of our Lord, a sign of hope, especially for those families in crisis or in grief. This is our assembly room, kind of like a reception area again, but that's a classroom, but if we need the extra space, we open up, like tonight, we open it up. A bell from Pachuca, Mexico chapel of the Holy Family, and we will celebrate sacraments here in this chapel. The stained glass windows were commissioned by Salem Stained Glass in East Bend, North Carolina. They're all original. They're not copies of any others. So the first window is the betrothal of Mary and Joseph in the temple. The stained glass window depicting the death of Joseph, patron saint of a peaceful death and really in marriage until death do you part. And then the Holy Family outside with the musical angels. Jesus blessing the children. Let the children come to me and do not hinder them. And what I call the mother's window of Mary with the infant Jesus with the adoring angel. The baptism of our Lord in the Jordan River. The Holy Spirit descending in the form of a dove. Very close to our baptismal font where persons are born into the new life. Christ. Yeah. My idea originally for this window was Joseph and Jesus in the carpenter shop. Now my vision of it would have been Joseph teaching Jesus how to use a, a tool like a chisel or a planer. Now the artist took that theme and he turned it around to where Jesus is speaking to Joseph. Joseph is attentively listening, and Mary wasn't even part of my idea originally for the window, and Mary is smiling, listening, and spinning. The Son, the Holy Spirit, come on your love us and be with you forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Okay. So when do we eat? Okay. <laughs>